actually his main, his actual main. Yeah. And like he was a Sheik player in Brawl, and um, he plays Sheik in this game as well. So let's see, no button checks, going straight into it. And the thing is with um, Greninja's jab, it's very fast, and she cannot really jab cancel against Greninja because he can mm. just jab. I think I'm, I'm pretty sure the jab is always like acts as a combo breaker whenever she jabs. Yeah. Ooh, oh, Eddie. Damn, reading the Putting jump. Putting in some work. Showing that Greninja isn't mid here, but yeah. can hold his ground against Sheik. And right there, uh, Sheik's got a space for forward air perfectly in order to not get punished. Otherwise, you're going to eat a jab. Hmm. And wow. You definitely need to be higher up to have a safe fare. Yeah. I like uh, Eddie's uh, shitting with the... What's it called? The, the tree? Not sure what the move is called. The, the tree? Uh, the Bushin? The replacement? Oh, the tree. Uh, What's it called? Shadow Sneak. Oh, yeah, that, yeah. I like Eddie's usage of it. Yeah, he has. He, he taught me he has a secret advanced technique with a Shadow Sneak. Okay. Which can uh, cancel some knockback with uh, certain moves. Oh, I've seen that, yeah. Amsa does that as well. Ah, oh, there you go. Yeah. He can basically do it uh, while he's in hit stun sometimes. Oh, uh, the counter is the tree and not the shadow sneak. Shadow oh, sneak okay. is the side B. Okay. I'm sorry. I, uh, had, I had no idea. Ooh, that was a risky four there, but yeah. not punished, surprisingly. Not getting punished. Wow. There is he the shadow sneak and takes the first stock of Sheik. Uh, Tries to get back. Close. Ooh. A risky jab as well. Yeah, but gets in with a neutral. Oh, but light getting back with a bounty fish. And at this percent, she has a little bit of trouble killing. Uh, yeah. I'd say at 140, she has an easier time killing because she has a lot more setups uh, from 140. But now, like, she the cannot do needles to bouncing fish or down throw to up The knockback just isn't yeah. is too high. So she's gotta do a single hit that kills, which is pretty hard for Sheik. Like but that barely, yeah, barely kills. But there it is. The one hit he needed. What uh, uh, what would be the moves you would use at that kind of percentage? Oh no, he has the um, um, at that percentage. I I'd, I'd go for bouncing. Oh, you mean at a high percentage? Yeah, if your opponent is at a high percentage, other than mm, bouncing fish. Honestly, I would just spam needles until uh, they make a mistake and they're in the air or something like that. Uh, and you know, since the new patch, you cannot let Trump people to back air that efficiently anymore. Mm. So you gotta be even more creative. But bouncing fish is usually a solid option. But if you miss your bouncing fish, it's uh, you leave yourself open. And of course, your opponent is gonna anticipate a bouncing fish at higher percent. Yeah, definitely. So it's pretty risky. But no, oh, ooh. that was a really nice spaced F smash. Getting a fort for a follow up. Yeah. I'm surprised he's not going for the bouncing fish. Yeah, I was going to say that too. Fort there was like 5 damage and bouncing fish just 12. But. Or maybe he just wants to keep it fresh, you know, doesn't want to steal his bouncing fish. That could be. That could be it. So he can kill with a bouncing fish yeah. at an earlier percentage and doesn't need to wait that long. I like to see uh, light air dodge out of that up throw because it's not a guaranteed combo. Then again, Eddie can punish his air dodge as well, but so far he's only been going for the for the up airs. And okay. Put these in the neutral. Yeah. Good rolling around. Ooh, that was a really Hits good bounce fish. fish, but just isn't enough. Uh, tried uh, reading his roll, but no roll for him. Nice, that's what I like yeah. to see. And now I hope Eddie like uh, adapts and catches the air, his air dodge. Let's see. Eddie just wants oh, air Eddie above just goes him. for it. Eddie oh, yeah. gets the up oh air. Okay. And Eddie takes the first game. That was, uh, that was pretty Didn't early. Didn't expect that. Nope, rage. Oh, closer? Okay. Is that better? Okay. All right. What would you pick as a counter pick against Greninja? Hmm. Personally, I'd almost always go with Battlefield against <laughs> any character. To have the platforms to yeah, do longer combos. Yeah, it's really good for Sheik, yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Um, if Battlefield's banned or striked, then I'd go for Smashville. Uh, I like to keep it simple. I'm sure Light thinks the same way. Let's see what they picked. I think he went Battlefield? Yeah, yeah okay. he went Battlefield. Alright, the thing is with this stage, on higher percents, um, she can needle someone at like 120, and they will pop off on the platform if you're gonna needle uh, in front of the platform. Okay. And it leads into a tech chase with up smash. Yeah. So that's one way of getting kills on Battlefield with Sheik. So Sheik has uh, an option of bouncing fish and up smash yeah, to get Yeah, exactly. And her up tilt also reaches uh, someone that's above her on the platform. Yeah. And they both, both hits connect, so it's pretty good shield pressure. So definitely not a surprise that uh, Light is counterpicking this character. But Eddie is still in the lead. Yeah, Eddie is still uh, a little bit in control. That was a risky down there. But Light just wa doesn't want him on stage. Okay. Eddie having a hard time getting back. But wow, there and he is. again, Eddie's so good with that. And it's not like he's overusing it or anything. He just uses it at the right moments. and it yeah. Almost always hit. Just as I say that, he uses it and it misses. <laughs> That's called commentator's curse. Yep. <laughs> is he going to... Yeah, uh, he gets back. Okay, let's see what he's going to do. Bouncing fish. Oh. <laughs> okay, Can't back throw. Oh, it tries to use the water. Yeah. Oh, uh, misses, misses the punish. The punish. Oh. And wow, oh, that was amazing. Gets the counter. He like baited him into grabbing and countered. Or actually, that wasn't counter, that was, uh, whatever that move's called. <laughs> Not the counter, at least. Uh, w was it the Shadow Sneak? Uh, I think it was the counter. Well, he didn't get hit. I'm not sure how the counter works, but... You can choose the direction you come in at. But the counter only works when they hit you, right? Yeah. But he didn't hit him. He whiffed a grab. Okay. I don't know, then. <laughs> I always thought it was a counter. <laughs> I mean, he has two moves that look really much alike. Yeah, probably just thinking of the wrong move. But Eddie doing some juggling here on Battlefield. Okay, and uses the up B to get away, but, oh, but Sheik, gets yeah, with Sheik is having fish. none of that with Bouncing Fish. She has all the mobility to just punish. Yeah, and Greninja, you cannot F tilt Greninja on 0%. He has uh, some kind of weird weight that allows him to fast fall. Okay. Oh. Okay. Now it's Light's turn for some juggling. All right, Light. Okay, Light. Oh no. Uh, the turn around. Oh, very risky bouncing fish. Uh. Okay, he tried again. Let's see. Does he go for a tech chase? He reads his regular get up. Oh. And jab is really solid. It does like 12 to 13 damage. Definitely a good move for Sheik. Very fast as well. Yeah. But not as fast as Greninja's jab, right? Um, I'm not sure. I think it's about as fast or Greninja's like one frame faster. Oh, gets the stage spike. Eddie missing the tech. Yeah, crucial tech. But oh, Sheik, oh, no. I wow. was just going to say, Sheik at a very high percentage. That was a and really good read by Eddie. Okay, that's what I like to see. Just keeping it simple. Forward tilt to bounce the fish. Okay, we okay. just got information that <laughs> Grand Ninja's down B is called Substitute. Okay, okay. Dude, I have no idea what the moves are called from Greninja. Okay, let's see. Jab, nice. And, yeah, Greninja's jab serves really well as a combo breaker. Yeah. Very fast jab. One of the best jabs. Very hard to DI out of as well. Yeah. But Light seemed to have turned around the situation, being in the yep. lead in percentage. Oh! Light with the clutch Gets read. The raw up smash. Yeah, that was really clutch. He was already charging it before he air dodged. Yeah. <laughs> so he like, he, he knew. Hard reads. Yep, the hard, hard reads. Oh. Alright. Well. Oh. Thank you, Chad. Thank you, Chad. You guys are very nice, Chad. It, it's actually my debut commentating. So, I'm Yeah, actually, I'm mine humbled. as well. So really? I actually never commentate for do some reason. You uh, always just do interviews. Oh, yeah, I On guess. 
Okay. But since I've been live streaming, I've been getting a little better at commentating matches. So okay. that definitely helps. Alright, I'm curious what uh, Eddie's going to counter pick here. Oh wait, was it 2-0? No. Why is he getting up then? Oh, Light just stretching his legs, I guess. Okay, Light apparently getting up. Oh, he wants some uh, water, okay. Sustenance. Yeah. And by yeah. the way, it's uh, worth mentioning that Eddie uses the Wii remote and nunchucks. Yep. You Ever since Brawl, he's still using it. You definitely don't see that. Not that often, very nope. <laughs> Zoom in. <laughs> yep. There it is. Oh, Light, you're blocking. Black nunchuck and white remote. Uh, we could theory craft on why they are di different colors. All right. What stage is he going to go with? Delfino. Delfino okay. Delfino Plaza. So do you think uh, he wants the low ceiling on the transformations? Um, yeah, that definitely helps, especially with his uh, up throw to up air, which already killed him pretty early the first game, but now he can kill even earlier with it, so that's nice. Then again, Sheik, um, Sheik can also kill with her up B. So not a bad stage for Sheik at all. And she can also down throw to up air at the right moment, and she can get early kills from that. But overall, I'd say it's better for Greninja. Okay. But Light so far showing uh, real dominance for his neutral game. Definitely. 70% in the lead, but Ooh. as I say it, Eddie <laughs> racking up some percent. Okay, I always love this part. This part is the most interesting. Uh, like <laughs> This part is just prone for spikes yeah. in the water. But it's like both characters don't really have a spike, so let's see how they deal with it. That's true. Sheik has a down air spike, but it's pretty hard to space. Yeah, and it's pretty risky too. Yeah, like I thought, Eddie goes for the up air. Well, I'd like to see Eddie reading the air dodge this time, or another time. Because uh, the light's been air dodging a lot. Now they're almost even, but light getting back in. Ooh, okay, he tried Ooh. reading his regular getup, but Eddie rolled to the left, and wow, and that's good. There is yeah. the low ceiling. Yeah, and like I said, yeah, air. getting an up air at low percents at the right moment, like when the stage is about to change, it's crucial. Yeah, now he has the lead. Okay, what she Almost can actually do here is she can just fair a uh, string, a Greninja, uh, to the right side of the stage and kill him. Oh, another clutch F smash by Eddie. He's getting, he's getting so many F smashes, killing Sheik pretty early. Uh, a little bit delay on his third jab. Okay, <laughs> what's going on? All right, Ooh, rolling nice. around. Both players hesitating a little bit with the jabs, but a very even game. Yeah, it, it just shows that the stage isn't really bad for any of those characters. Nope. Okay. But Eddie doing some oh, juggling. Oh, Eddie is just juggling Sheik so well. Oh, uh, missed the up smash. Delayed his fastball with the downer and tricked Eddie into doing a move. Very smart. And again. Ooh. That's a f oh. Okay. Greninja's uh, run up grab is a lot faster than the standing grab. So you're gonna see Eddie trying to uh, dash up and grab a lot. Ooh, tried to go for the hard read and Eddie doesn't know that that auto cancels. He should have released it a little bit earlier. Back to neutral. Catches him yeah. grab. Cross oh, and gets okay. the up and air This kill. time light air dodges. So Eddie is adapting really well. But Eddie also had a high percentage and is in a very dangerous situation. Hmm. That uh, bouncing bouncy fish right there, it's a huge risk because you're giving away stage position. Uh, like you could get the kill with bouncing fish, but if you miss, you're on the edge. Then you just give away stage position. Oh, tries to do some hard reads with the up Oh, oh okay. okay, that was an excellent bouncing downbeat. fish. Now at an even game again. Yeah, this is uh, really even. Okay, I like that neutral air. And wow, good combos by Eddie. Okay, he waited for the bouncing fish this time. And Eddie is getting so much out of that up throw up air. He's been hitting almost every single one. Eddie just isn't giving like any space to breathe. Okay, that's what I like to see. Uh, a well not well spaced fair can always be punished by jab. So Eddie knows that, and he punishes accordingly with jab. Okay, that was a good spot dodge. Eddie has to be careful here because if she gets one fair, and they're close to the uh, to the sides, she can bounce fish and they'll die pretty early. Ooh. Okay. 
Alright, I think that's the first time we've seen uh, Eddie do back air the whole set. <laughs> okay, he tried. I haven't seen that move, the substitute move in a while. Oh, oh. Reed is a jump! It and Light, can. very happy about his win. Oh. <laughs> the camera still zoomed in on Eddie's face. Eddie is just indifferent, as yeah. always, but Light, very happy. Yeah, that was a good set. Hip. That was a very good set. Yeah, that was very hype. But all. Yeah, Eddie definitely not happy friendly about that. Passion. All right, very hype set. Okay, I'm, I'm wondering very who's close. up next. I think winners quarters or semis I is about to start. I think we are still in quarters. Okay. If it were semis, you would 